Hey there, people. Well, today's uh, returning the aluminum day. So yeah, I'm just going to return the aluminum I stripped the other day and see what I get for that. I'm just going to pull that fridge out, leave it here until I get more. Like, it's really not worth returning one fridge. Like, it might be seven bucks, eight bucks, ten bucks. Oh, the lunchbox got some mail in it. It's wet. Seriously, are you kidding me? No way. I gotta read this letter. Seriously, Greg? Like, come on, man. That's just not right, dude. Like, if, like the coaster would have been just awesome. Like, as if you send me cash. Thanks, buddy. Appreciate it very much. Can't forget the pizza, pizza, blue box material. All right, we got the fridge unloaded. Let's see if it's still here when I get back. So we'll load that uh, aluminum crap and see what we get for that. While I'm at the scrapyard, I'm gonna ask him about this motor, see what I get for it just like that, because I really don't. It's not that I'm lazy, it's just, it's hard to work with one hand. See what they give me for that, just like that. Well, there it is. Let's see if all my hard work is gonna pay off. The way the prices are, I doubt it, but I can't be negative, never know. Could be a million dollars. <laughs> I only wish. Okay, let's go to the scrapyard. Hopefully I don't get too discouraged. You don't, you don't want the Play-Doh? <laughs> Alright. Castings, 85 pounds. Irony, 8 pounds. Oh, I don't have to wait. I was weighing in, they just out of habit. Don't have to weigh in. All that work. 4160. Yeah, 4160. Anyway, I guess it's kind of free money if you don't count the labor. I take it back, it's not free money. Like, I did have to find this shit. The labor I'll give, but I still had to find the shit. Does that make any sense? So I'm taking the labor back too. Scrapping's not worth it anymore, really. With the gas prices out the roof. I just need to get drunk, maybe. Yeah, let's do that. <laughs> well, I'm back home. I decided to keep this motor for now because uh, they just want to give me tin price for it. But I mean, after seeing what I got for the aluminum, it's not really worth stripping it. But anyway, I was reading my comments and uh, Doughboy Scrappy, he commented that he might have seen a cat back here. So let's have a look. Is it a cat? I'm not sure. Anyway, I'm gonna put it aside till I find out what it is. If it's a cat, like I can get up to 90 bucks for it. But I don't know. We'll find out. Well, I'm just gonna do a little cleanup. I'm gonna load as much of this little shit as I could. It's not little, but light shit, I guess. I'm not gonna get much for this. Okay, let's get her loaded. <coughs> you look pretty relaxed, our big fella. What you doing, Jage? Hi, right, what you doing, buddy?
Lazy days of summer, eh, buddy? <laughs> it's just like the game Tetris. Oh, well, there we go. Even neighbor Dave's bike's going. Somebody was asking me if I cut the cords off the fridges and stuff. Of course I do. I've got a huge box inside, too, of it. It's all my brass and stuff. I know, I know. I should take the copper off of that and take the motor out, but you know what? Screw it. I'm kind of discouraged at the prices, so I just want to clean out my yard for now. Alright, let's return this crap. Well, before we go to the scrapyard, I gotta pick Shelly up from work. I don't know if she's gonna come to the scrapyard with us. She's not a big fan. <laughs> And there she is. Who? You. Oh. <laughs> I thought you were pointing somebody out to me. No, no hotties come out yet, except for you. Yeah, well, you know. What are we going to do? So you want to come to the scrapyard? It would save us a lot of gas money. A lot, eh? Well, okay, I'll go to the scrapyard. Yeah, but what kind of car? It's a convertible. <laughs> Here we go again, 120 a ton. I'm gonna go in and talk to the owner about the uh, engine block though. I should get at least dirty aluminum price for that, not just tin price. Well that paid off better than I thought. I got 26 bucks for that motor and 46.80 for the tin, so. Can't complain, I guess. Well, I guess Shelly's cooking tonight. I started the queue up and uh, let's see what she's cooking. So I've been messing with my yard, I cut the grass there. Um, like there's a lot of yellow spots coming through so what I did, I gave it a good treatment of miracle Girl. Like this stuff works amazingly, like seriously. Like not crazily but uh, like maybe a teaspoon in that bucket and I just, what, four or five buckets I think it was. So watch the yellow come back. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna cut this side now. Cooking some mixed vegetables. Okay. Broccoli, cauliflower, and carrots. And the meat, it's a mystery, we'll see. It's a pork loin. Ooh, pork loin. On the barbecue. Hickory deer, hickory deer, Hickey, hickory dickory dock tonight, or? Have another fucking uh, drink there, dude. So hickory dickory tonight? You want some hickory dickory? No. No hickory dickory smoker? No, no it's hickory. Huh? No hickory smokers. You don't like the hickory no more? Well, it's all wet, look at it. sneak in some hickory in there for sure let's get this thing smoking a little smoky it smells great I'll tell you that talking to the barbecue it's talking back did you hear it it said thank you for the hickory chips I really appreciate that JJ's gonna like it hey buddy Look at what you did to my freaking meat. <laughs> Why would I have done that? It's you. No. Look at Shelly's it's cooking. It's totally you. I like crispy though. You're eating the crispy part. For I sure. Part. Well, I'm going to burn that little piece there till it's crispy, crispy. Mmm. Crispy. Well, a big, big thank you to uh, Craig from uh, 13 Racing Pigeons YouTube. You go straight to the wall, buddy. 
There we go. Right on, people. Well, cheers. And thanks for watching. We'll see you guys later.